How can a revocable living trust help me with incapacity planning? Uh, a revocable living trust is a, it's a, it's a holding device. So you transfer the ownership of all your property into the trust where you get to manage it while you're healthy. When you become incapacitated, you set up a successor trustee. And when you're no longer able to make those decisions on how to manage stuff, either it's permanent or temporarily, you can resign as trustee, your successor trustee takes over and they get to manage everything for you based on the language that you've set up in the trust of what they have to do. So because you're no longer in charge, because the, the trust owns the property and you don't, your successor trustee gets to manage everything without court involvement. When you were, if you are able to recover from your incapacity, you can, can take back over and be trustee, uh, just like it, just like before. Uh, but you don't have to, again, don't have to have that court involvement.